Hi, it's Micro here, and once again, we have our friend Farrell uh, trapped in the house <laughs> to make YouTube videos. Uh, I hope that's okay. Um, I'm, I'm actually really happy. I've been unchained from the radiator and chained to the fridge. We invested in a longer <laughs> chain. I thought it's the least we could do. <laughs> Now, gents, you may remember a short while ago we did a video where you had to guess the foreign film titles. Yeah, uh, I remember. <laughs> and I lost. Give it to you. Well done. Well done. <laughs> <laughs> right, right, we're off to the night. <laughs> we're off to the pub. See you yeah. later. You may also remember there was a forfeit and a, uh, a reward. There is once again a forfeit and a reward for this following competition. The forfeit will be... Oh yeah, I don't know this. Actually, no. The reward will be uh, a, couple of, a couple of drinks at the pub, my treat after we've done filming. We may even let you off the chain if you win. <laughs> Yay! The forfeit... Yeah, here we go. <laughs> oh, I don't like it. You're laughing already. <laughs> the forfeit is watching The Notebook. Now this is... A... <laughs> Again! <laughs> this is a win-win for me. Because if Farrell loses, he has to watch The Notebook for the first time. And if Ro loses, he has to watch The Notebook for the third time. Yeah, the, fir the, fir the first time was a long time ago. I, I thought never again. The second time, forfeit, fair enough. I hate you. We, um, <laughs> if this is me, I bet you've read this so that he, he knows these. <laughs> it's all of Farrell's favourite films. So basically the competition is... Um, every now and then on Twitter, there will be a trending hashtag, and that hashtag is explain a film plot badly. So by the badly described film plot, you have to guess what. Okay, the so this is, this Ooh. isn't like where the, the other one where it was like what is this in this country they named this film? This no, so okay. this is something completely different. You but you got to think in the mind of someone who hashtags <laughs> badly. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> yeah, the thing is, we're not going to have an age demographic, so we're not going to know who... Yeah. yeah, so... Now, would you like your buzzers? Basically, yes. I'm going to oh, read out the badly uh, explained film plots, and whoever crunches on their crisp first gets to answer first. Now, however, if you answer first and you get it wrong, the other person then has a little bit longer to think about their answer. So don't okay. just I'm jump feeling, in. I'm feeling alright because if he feels he knows it, he's gonna he, he, he's chosen potato sticks. We chose our own buzzer sounds, kind of. Potato he's potato got potato sticks. sticks. I'm gonna be able to out crunch that surely. <laughs> no, I don't want to pick I've favorites. Got a smaller amount of crunch. <laughs> I don't want to pick favorites and say who I want to win. But Roe watching The Notebook for a third time would be absolutely brilliant. So, Farrell, if you can make oh, that happen... Oh, oh, compa <laughs> the, the compassion you're showing here. Right, the first one is just an example. So, for example, a love triangle between an 18-year-old girl, a 100-year-old guy and a dog. What film do you think that might be? I know neither of you well. So, so can you say that again? I don't think you would have seen this. A love triangle between an 18-year-old girl, a 100-year-old guy, and a dog. Why is the dog's age not mentioned? Marley and me? <laughs> Beethoven? It is... Oh, no, Beethoven don't fit. What am I thinking? It's Twilight. Oh. No, I know. What? <laughs> I, I watch good films. What? <laughs> no, I've used Don't just say, why we got why you brought up Twilight? That Robert, does Robert make Patterson sense. Batman. I don't know how I feel about that. Give him a chance, but that's for another video, but give him okay. a chance. Give him a chance. Okay. He's a good actor, but in bad films. That's all I'm saying on that matter. Um, so here we go. That was just an example. I used that one because I don't think he really I know it, very so. little of Twilight. Where's the dog come into it? Um, the, the wolf. The wolf. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, right, competition time. Oh, okay. before, we, before we start, yep. I'd, I'd like to make an apology. Go on. In the previous video, Mike, Mike you said that he, he had to do a lot of editing because we were a little bit misbehaved. <laughs> so I'd, 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 I'd like to <laughs> apologise. I would really <laughs> love to apologise. But I won't because... <laughs> <laughs> Now 
maybe you're gonna edit this video. How do you like that? <laughs> can, can we just change change your questions quickly? He can watch a notebook. <laughs> Yeah, in fact, <laughs> there is no competition. It's just a video on Farrell watching the moment. But here we go. Are you ready? Competition time. There's ten of these all together. The first crunch gets to answer first. Explain a film plot badly. A wise cracking boiler technician teaches high school students to believe in their dreams. There are clues in the title. A wise cracking boiler technician teaches high school students to believe in their dreams. Emphasis on the dreams. Okay, this may be harder than I first thought it was going to be. Never seen it. I'm thinking of dreams. I'm thinking of parodies where they go, it's like a dream within a dream. So, Inception? No. No? Do you yeah, want to take I a guess, Farrell? I've got to be well out on that. But if he don't know it, I'll throw, I'll, I'll throw a guess. Matrix? No, it was a Nightmare on Elm Street. Ah, oh, yeah. lovely. I've not so seen it. It's, but you know the concept. It makes sense sure. though, right? Yeah, it does make sense. So at least you it now know sense. the kind yeah. of wavelength we're going on here. Right, here we go. <laughs> Explain ah. a film plot badly. Group spends nine hours returning jewellery. I'm going to put the emphasis on the most important part. Return. Group spends nine hours returning jewellery. Okay, this is so much harder <laughs> than I thought it was going to be. If you guys have worked it out before these guys, please let us where, know. Where are your buzzers? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to do the emphasis on the most important part. We know them, but it's jewellery! <laughs> it is. You said jewellery. <laughs> I'll just, um, I'll give him a moment. See, you put the emphasis on jewellery, I'm, I'm thinking of titles, the film titles with jewel in the title, but it's, but it's the group. Okay, think of different types of jewellery. And uh, as soon as it pops, yes? Lord of the Rings. Yes! It's a good start. One nil to Farrell. Explain a film plot badly. I'm not gonna say that every time. <laughs> Are you ready? You could get this in the first word. Noseless guy has an unhealthy obsession with a teenage boy. <laughs> Harry Potter. It is! One all. Well done. One all. Do you want do you want the rest of one of them or are you just gonna accept that? <laughs> I accept that. That's good. Okay. Um I'll give you a little bit of a clue on this one. It is a messed up film. Small Town Doctor brings three people closer together. Yep. Centipede. I'll give you that, the human centipede. Yeah, well done, 2-1. Two, one. Next up. Unsuspecting boy is seduced by a creepy old loner into a game of crime, terrorism and incest. Unsus I've got an idea, but no. Do you want to go for it? You can no, get there first. No, no, no. Unsus if it's what I think it is, it can't be because he would have got it. Back to the Future. Yes. yes. <gasps> no way! <laughs> yes. You love that film as well. <laughs> that makes you it love too that film. Read that out again. Unsuspecting boy yeah. is seduced by a creepy old loner yeah. into a game of crime, terrorism, and incest. Yeah. <laughs> That's a really good argument you, you put there, Ro. What a... <laughs> Next film. So 2 1, right? I think it is 2 1. 3 1. Mm. Ooh. Mm. Oh, yeah. You had to be paying attention, didn't you? Mm. Here we go. Paranoid billionaire afraid of immigrants. It was a film. It was a film out about four presidential years election. <laughs> Is that your answer? No, no. I haven't crunched. No. So what, what, what are you saying at the end there? Paranoid billionaire, yeah. afraid of immigrants. I'll give you a little clue. When we say immigrant, we're talking came from far, far away. Have you guys got it? Comment below. Superman? 
Do you want to expand on that slightly? Return to? <laughs> I know, I know. All right, if Farrell's got the cor- the the full answer. Batman versus Superman. It is, yeah. I d- okay, I, d- I don't know what to do here. I don't know whether to give you that point. He he did say he, Superman, which kind of I had no clue until he said Superman. That that's the joy, that that's the thing about waiting though. For someone else to answer, you gave the correct film title. I'd give him the point. But I didn't know until you said Superman. And then I was expecting you to turn around and say Batman is versus Superman. Like, ah, I ah, wish this was a live video ah. because you guys could make the decision for me. I think I'm going to give Ray the answer. Really? Then, what? I think. I mean, I, I I accept. You but... got you. Got where we were going with that, and that's good enough for me. Three letters two. wise, you got half the letters. <laughs> <laughs> the title, yeah, just yeah. Here we go. <laughs> wow, that I, that that's very. I, I... Let's you, keep you going. You seem really moved by this. Are you okay? I'm, I I just think that if I was watching this, I'd be like. F no, Farrell got it. <laughs> I don't, like, I'm in a predicament then, I don't know what to but do. But I don't want to watch The Notebook again. <laughs> it's like, it, this is, don't, don't you see how chivalrous I'm being here? It's either 3 2 or 4 1. What would you like it to be? Well, obviously, I'd like it to be 3 2. <laughs> but the competitive Nate person yeah, in me says, no, no one wins by cheating, you're only cheating yourself. Right, I'm the adjudicator let, and I gave you the point. Let's, let's review after a few more. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm giving you the point, I'm giving you the point. Wow. Here we go, next film. A series of naps. Sleepers? No. I'm not going to give a clue. There's a clue I really want to give, but I'm not going to give oh, it. I'll give a clue, it's fine. A series of naps. Do you know I'm going to give the clue and let Ro get back in the game. Uh, I think that's fair. The clue is, it's an answer one of you has already said. You have given this answer for another question. A series of naps. You guys watching this, I'm sure you've probably worked it out and are screaming at the monitor. A series of naps. I can't remember the other cl- the answer I gave to the other clues. <laughs> I think you might have said it, I'm not sure. I can't remember now. Go on. Sleepers in Seattle. <laughs> you no, said that. that! That was the one we did about four weeks ago. Oh, <laughs> I, 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 I sometimes have a memory. <laughs> sometimes. Okay. Can I just get a repeat on question one again, please? No. One? No. No. Um, no. Definitely not. That one's gone. Yeah, That's I'm going to... I just want to hear, I just want to hear <laughs> the no. clues. <laughs> no. <laughs> People are probably screaming at the monitor as to how unfair this competition is. I can't is. remember what we I'm going to repeat what the first one is. <laughs> <laughs> With Farrell back in the game. Oh. Oh. Are you ready? A no. wise cracking boiler technician teaches high school students to believe in their dreams. Dreams. And what was the clue to this one? Oh yeah. Dreams. It's the only other answer I can remember. Inception. It is. And that may <laughs> I can't I, I... No, I, think... Ed, I, I literally just picked question one. I couldn't remember how many we'd done, but I knew we'd done one. I think that was fair to bring you back in the game and give the original one. Uh, that you help me out with the scores here, I forget. Five, six to me. <laughs> Have we done 11? No. <laughs> no it's, it's, um... I think it might be like four. Well, I've got, if I got that one, you get, I've got three if you've given me the other one. So how, how many have you done all together? Right, six. No, it's seven one, because Negro has got the first three, one. Three, four, five, six, seven. And I've got, if you're giving me the other one, then I've got three. So it's free all then. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> and there is only three left. Oh. Are you ready? Yes. Mm-hmm. Oh wait. <laughs> <laughs> Lunatic enslaves chocolate making entertainers, slowly killing Are you children crunching? in front Are of you their crunching? He was crunching. Are you crunching? Yes or no? <laughs> I was hungry. <laughs> I was hungry. <laughs> what do you want from the chocolate factory? Yes. Were you were you serious? Farrell, that's no! 
You're supposed to only chew when you want to answer. Alright, alright, alright. <laughs> so that makes it five... Four, three. Four, three. Oh, to... To me. To you. The plot thickens. If I get the next one, I'm going to make it very interesting. But only if I get this one. A young man forcibly binds other men and photographs them for money. It's not the main plot, but it happens in the film. A young man forcibly binds other men and photographs them for money. So hang on, the, the, the concept is people describe films with bad descriptions, and this isn't even the main point of the film. It's not the main plot, but it, it does it does feature heavily in one of the films. All right, one more thing, one more time, because I've got, oh, in one of the, oh, so this is a series of films. A young man forcibly binds other men and photographs them for money. A newspaper photographer is one of his jobs, or his job. Spider-Man. It is, it is. Okay. That means he can't win this. No, right? no, no. Here's where I'm gonna make it interesting. The point earlier that I think should have gone to battle <laughs> goes to battle, and that makes this four all. And this is the last one. Ooh. Do you guys agree? What do you think? Not if you, you agree, <laughs> then you know, you, you know this is right or wrong. If you don't agree, I would have won anyway. But I, I, because I personally thought Farrell should have got that point earlier. No, that's fair enough. Yeah, this is I, for all. I ex yeah, I agree. That's this fair enough. That's fair enough. It comes I can't down believe to I'm putting myself in the firing line for Notebook. So basically, Ro could be watching a very cheeky flicky film um, for the third time, and Farrell could be watching it for the first time. Either way, this is brilliant. I love this. Are you ready? Deadbeat Dad. What? Dad tries to get his son to take over the family business. I'm going to put an emphasis on probably the most important words. Deadbeat Dad tries to get his son to take over the family business. Actually, let me reword it. Hang on, hang on. Is the dad dead? Deadbeat father tries to get his son to take over the oh, family oh. business. <laughs> yes. I, I've got ideas of where it's going. From Star Wars. But... So who is going to be watching the notebook? Is it really Star Wars? It's Star Wars for the third time. <laughs> Mr. Rowe is going to be watching The Notebook <laughs> like before. The camera will be on him the whole time whilst me and Farrell are at the pub just to make sure that he is watching it for the whole duration of the movie. Who wrote these descriptions? <laughs> the internet! The internet's <laughs> stupid! Thank you for watching, please subscribe, click the like button and now over to the footage of Roe watching The Notebook for a third time. <laughs> it's actually... No, I can't even joke about it. I was going to say it's actually not that bad. Um, yeah, it really is. Um, there's probably people out there that love this film. Have you watched it more than once? I'll say to that. This is bad. Mm -hmm. Oh God, this is even cheesier than I remember. That better not be a fourth time. Breakfast, math to Latin to the lunch, tennis lesson, dance lesson. Something. I saw your picture in the paper. Is he still? The one with you in the house. And I just wanted to come oh, and see if you were okay. Oh, you enjoyed the notebook! Shut up, it's getting to a good oh, bit! Oh, look at oh, you! No, ending! Oh, oh, such a romantic oh, Screw bit. you! Screw <laughs> you! Let me watch the fighter pilot scene. At least that's something to look forward to in this film. Okay, good. What if I just fed you?